guys <laughs> today we're doing a Shein unboxing this is gonna be fun so let's get this opened this isn't smart you shouldn't be cutting towards yourself what did I buy okay all right okay guys let me do a more proper intro than that <laughs> today i'm going to be doing a shein unboxing i'm so excited i actually purchased this like a few weeks ago they have their black friday sales going on for a pretty long time i'm pretty sure it's going to be even like more discounted closer to black friday but i think i purchased this around the beginning of november oh i bought some makeup <gasps> i literally just filmed a get ready with me right before i started this video which will be probably up by now you might have seen it last week but i was talking about this brow pencil this is my favorite brow pencil and i didn't think i ordered it i forgot i ordered it i thought i was gonna order it like in my next order I wanted to do like another video testing out new shein makeup um so i thought i was gonna order it from what i remembered i thought i was gonna order the brow pencil with that order um which i also mentioned in my last video that i want to do like another shein video because you guys really seem to like that one and i honestly was really surprised by shein makeup so i definitely want to try some more stuff out but um yeah so this would have been really handy 30 minutes ago when i was doing my makeup you guys haven't heard of shein which i don't know who hasn't heard of shein by now but it's a very affordable online boutique and they have it's mostly like women's clothing and accessories and makeup and everything <laughs> but um they also have a home department they have men's clothing they have kids like toddlers babies clothing um they have a pet department they literally have everything so it's really cool especially if you're on a budget like some of their stuff is hit or miss some stuff is made very cheaply which you can expect because it costs very cheap but they do have like a higher end department as well where they have like cashmere and silk and stuff like that but i just read reviews for anything i purchase unless i'm doing a video like a testing out makeup video then i just don't look at the reviews because i'm going to review that for you and i want to decide for myself what i think about it but when it comes to clothes i just always read the reviews because the sizing can also be hit or miss sometimes they run small sometimes they run big and also i always look at the materials um before i purchase so that's a little tip from shopping on Shein. You can also like filter it to your size, obviously, and stuff like that. Um, but anyway, let's just go ahead and jump into this haul. I ordered mostly stuff for myself because I'm going to the cabins very soon, like in a week or two. So I mostly just got some hats for myself and some fuzzy socks and stuff. And then I also got a few things for my husband. Um, but if you guys are new to my channel, please be sure to subscribe and like this video. It really helps me out with the algorithm and boosts my videos. Also share this video with a friend if you're feeling extra generous and let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and just dive right into this box. I'm just going to pull out random things. I'm excited about this. I remember this being like $1.50, which is crazy because, uh, what's it called? Amazon and stuff like that or like Instagram boutiques, they can be a lot more expensive. But these, this would have been handy while doing my makeup earlier today too but these are like the little hair clips that don't crease your hair so while you're doing your makeup or whatever you can just clip your hair back with this and it won't crease your hair and i really like these little like tortoise styled ones very cute very cute <laughs> anyways i'm excited to have these i can just like put some in the bathroom put some by the mirror where I normally do my makeup, put some in my desk where I sometimes do my makeup, just have them everywhere because they came in a pretty big pack for $1.50. So that's the first thing I got. Socks. This is my second time ordering socks from Shein. The first time I ordered like the no-show socks and those are really nice. These colors are so cute. Let me actually pull out my order on my phone so I can tell you guys the prices. I'm sure you guys want to know. So the clips were $1.50 but with a coupon code or like with a Thanksgiving or Black Friday sale it was $1.22. The socks were originally $7 and I got them for $5.69. So the thing I thought was weird when I was looking at the reviews is that they're literally just like flat like they're not shaped for your foot but the reviews looked really good and I just figured it just will shape to your foot anyway. 
but I don't know. What I mostly liked about these is one, I like how they're like this ribbed material and then also if you guys look at the inside, it's like this really fuzzy fleecy material. So that's exciting, especially since we'll be in the cabins and it's going to be really cold. I want some fuzzy socks. I'm trying to take off my sock and try these on. <gasps> Ooh, they feel so soft. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah. So the that's not a problem that it was like shaped that way. It actually fits really nicely and they're super, super soft. Oh my gosh. Like I know they're soft, but it was just a very unexpected feeling when you put them on. These are super cute. Okay, I recommend these. I kind of want to put the other one on. Okay, you guys definitely need these. <laughs> these are so soft. Oh my goodness. And I love these colors, like this green and this little taupey color and this color, mustardy color. This one's all right too. I wish it was a little more like less mauvey and more like blushy, like a warm pink, but it's okay because we got these. <laughs> um, okay, next. So I got some hats and these were super cheap. These were $3.50 normally, but I got them for $2.85 each. And I just ended up getting these two little like beanie hats. I got a white one and this taupey color and it just has this little emblem on it. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. This is so cute. I'm excited to wear this. It's not fuzzy. I'm definitely going to be wearing this this winter and at the cabins especially. Very cute. Let's try the white one on. I already know I'm going to end up getting makeup all over this. This is the same theme. So it's the same exact style hat, just a different color. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, I love this. Cute. Oh, I got my shoes. More shoes. <laughs> that's so small. Oh my gosh. I expected this to be like a whole sheet, at least like this big. But I got these little nail stickers, which are really cute. They were like a dollar. I'll tell you for sure. Well, it was a dollar, but they were on sale for 81 cents. I mean, it's 81 cents, I'm not complaining, but I just thought it was going to be like a whole sheet, like a big sheet. I hope these all fit. Some of them look like they might be too big on my fingernails, but I picked up these little nail art stickers, which I thought would be really cute for fall. Cute. Ordered like five shoes. It's not good because recently I did a, like a shoe clean out and I had like almost a hundred pair of shoes. I think I had like 95 pairs of shoes and I ended up getting rid of some. I might have like 85 pairs of shoes now. Well, now I'm back to 90 because I just bought five more. Um, I love shoes. I can't help it. Um, let's just start off with, actually, you know what, since we were talking about the hats, let's finish with the hats. Oh, these are cute. The material is a little different than what I expected, but like, it's not as soft as I expected, but they're still cute. Okay, so I got these two berets, and they were $2.44 each. And I've always wanted a beret, but then I... I don't know why I never got one. Do they have enough stretch to them? I don't know how to wear these. <laughs> why do I look like uh, a chef, like, from Ratatouille? Am I doing this wrong? Hold on. How did they wear it? There's no like pictures, like advertisement pictures of people wearing them, but let me look at the review pictures. Okay. Is that how I should wear it? Guys, I don't know how I feel about this. There's no way I am wearing this out. Okay, I think some people are wearing it, like, instead of putting it on like this, they have it, like, folded in. Maybe that's how I'm supposed to do it. Oh, okay. That looks so much better already. There you go. Okay, guys, if you've never worn a beret before, don't... Oh, that's how actually they had it shipped in. I folded it out but it was supposed to be folded in and then you put it on. 
Okay, that's really cute. And also, the shoes that I got are going to match perfectly with this hat. Well, not perfectly, but it'll still look cute together. So I got these like sock shoes, sock heels. Let me tell you how much they are. So these were originally $27 and I got them for $21.92. Let's hope they fit. Also guys, ignore the fact that I'm in my pajamas. They're just really cozy. Oh my gosh, this with my new socks. Like this is so comfortable. Let me get up and show you guys. And these fit perfectly. I got a size, let me tell you what size I got. I'm normally a six and I got a 36, so they do fit. Oh, a size 36 is actually a five and a half. So I ended up getting a five and a half. So I did size down a little bit and I'm really happy that they're not like big around my ankle. That's what I was afraid of, that they would be big, but they fit really good, especially with these like soft socks on. Cute, oh my goodness. Love these. And ignore the fact that I'm in my pajamas, but these are really cute. Okay, so I'm super happy with these. They have like a suede heel and the rest of it is like this stretchy ribbed fabric material. There's a hair on there. Um, but yeah, I really like these. I'm excited to style some outfits with them. And then also, this color is a little bit off from what I expected, but they're still cute. So I expected these to match perfectly. Kind of wish this was a little more this color. So they're a little bit off. Let me show you what it looked like on camera or like on the ad. I mean, on the viewfinder, it looks the same, but when I compare them to side by side this looks a little more of a camel color and this one just has like a little bit of a burnt orange color to it i mean i'm not too mad <laughs> i still like them i'm still gonna wear them i just don't know if they will look cute with this hat that was my plan was to wear it with the hat but we'll see also guys these little like pouches that the shoes come in is really handy for when you're traveling and you're putting your shoes in your suitcase and you don't want like the bottom of the shoes like once you've worn them you don't want the bottom of the shoes to get like your clothes or anything else dirty it's really convenient to just put them in these little like dust bags that way you don't get anything dirty in your bag obviously they fit the same like the other pair because i bought the same size Oh no, guys, we're coming close to the end of this haul. Felt like Christmas. <laughs> okay, I learned how to wear these hats. <laughs> so here are these heels right here. They're very cute. I wish they were a little bit more on like the cooler side. They're a little too like burnt orange for me, but they're still really cute and I'll still wear them. I just wish they were a little more like this color, you know? Or like the hat rather than like this burnt orangey color. <laughs> but I'm, I'm still happy with them. They're just not what I was expecting, but I still like them. I would have liked them more if they were like more like this color, like I said, but I still like them. So yeah, that was my second pair of shoes. So next, let's see, let's open it together. Yes, this is the color that I was kind of aiming for oh my goodness i'm so excited i've been wanting to grow my boot collection so i picked up these cute little like nude boots see this would look cute together let's try them on yes they fit perfectly thank god so let me show you guys these look how cute i've been wanting a pair of nude boots super cute you know what now that i'm walking in them a little bit they're just very like there's no squishiness or support in them. So like whenever your toes hit this part, like in the shoe, it kind of just hurts. It's like rock hard. <gasps> Did I just do that? There's like a little scuff right there. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh no, I hope it comes off, but um, yeah, maybe if I just wear some fuzzier socks or something hopefully they don't really hurt the same way but 
I still like them as long as they're not too painful to walk in. <laughs> okay, moving on to shoe number two. <laughs> I got the same pair of shoes in brown. Look how cute. Oh my gosh, I finally have options with my boots because all I had was like black boots. Like for flat boots, for heeled boots, I had some options, like some colored options, but for like flat boots like this, like Chelsea boots or whatever you want to call them, I only had black. So now I have options. So cute. I'm excited to finally have some brown boots. Love them. I have one more item for myself, one more pair of shoes, and then I have three items that I got for my husband. My hat was cut off. Okay. The last pair I'm also really excited about is, ta-da, some cream boots. Did I tell you guys the prices of these? I don't think so. So the brown were $24.35, originally $30. Those beige ones were $25.91, originally $32. And these ones are $25.17, originally $31. Let's try them on. Hmm, should I have sized up? Like a half a size. I ended up getting 36 for all of these, which is a, it says a size six. It's weird because with the heels, it said size euro 36 is equivalent to five and a half. And then for these ones, it says size 36 is equivalent to a size six. Um, I don't know. Anyways, let me show you these. So here is these cream boots, which I'm super excited about. I've been wanting a pair of cream off-white boots for a while and I finally have them and they're super cute. I could have tried a little bit harder and put on a cute pair of pants instead of my pajamas. <laughs> sorry, but not sorry. Anyway, so yeah, these are super cute, but again, they're like a little uncomfortable around the toe. I hope that's not going to be a problem. Um, maybe I should have sized up. They don't have the best return policy. You have to like pay to return. Maybe I should have gotten a size 37, which is a six and a half. All right, so the last three items, like I said, were for my husband. So I'm gonna scoot back because I'm gonna try to show them off to the side. I never ordered clothes for like men for my husband on the Shein website. So I'm hoping these will be nice. We were going out recently for our anniversary and he didn't have, like he didn't fit any of his nice coats, even though these aren't like super warm coats. They're not like luxe thick like winter coats but still it's like a nice like I don't know they're still kind of nice like lightweight jackets um he grew out of all of his they were all small on him so I had to order some more for him I didn't have to but I did so starting off with this one this one was oh my goodness that's a good deal I think this like they were having like some pieces in particular, if you buy three, it was like 50% off. And then on top of that was a, like the Black Friday sale. So this shirt right here, this is the Shein Men Plaid Hooded Shirt. This was originally $22 and I got it for $8.93. Wow. I thought it was really cute. I love it. It has like a little hood in the back. It's very thin. I was hoping it'd be a little bit thicker. Um... But this with like a white t-shirt underneath or maybe like a white long sleeve for when it's not too cold outside but maybe it's a little chilly. I thought that was cute. The next item, this one is thicker. That's kind of what I was hoping that last piece to be. This one was originally $35 and I got it for $14.21. The men's stuff was really on sale. But I found this really cute like camel jacket. <laughs> And I thought it was really cute and it's pretty thick it's not like the softest coziest material on the inside but it is thick and if he wears obviously a cozy shirt underneath it won't really matter so yeah I got this and the last thing I got was originally $30 and I got it for $12.18 and it's like this like kind of windbreaker raincoat type of material <laughs> let me try to step back I thought this was really cute and this one actually feels like a lot nicer quality like the inside is lined with like this satin or silk lining hope you guys can hear me and not like all this noise 
This inner lining does make it feel a lot nicer. But again, it's also pretty lightweight. For the price, I am not complaining. Those are really, really affordable. So I wouldn't be upset if they came in any worse than it is. But if I paid like, I don't know, like 60 bucks for them and they came in looking like that, I would have been really disappointed. So overall, I'm happy with my purchases. I'm excited to do my nails. Mine are kind of growing out, so this will be kind of fun to do. Comment down below, should I do this like mustardy and bluish kind of folly vibes or this like mauve -y colored ones? I'm kind of leaning towards this one. I don't know, we'll see. That is all for this video. Hope you guys enjoy this haul. Um, I'm excited with my new shoes. I'm looking at them right now. I have like five pairs of shoes laid out in front of me and I'm so excited. That's it for this video, guys. Again, please don't forget to like and comment down below. Please subscribe if you haven't already. All that good stuff, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. I'm popping back in real quick because I completely didn't see this in the bottom of the box, but I also got these nail stickers, which are really cute and like nude kind of compared to these, but yeah. So I ended up getting three. <laughs> Now I have more options. Now that's all for the video. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.